Hello, it's Fraser Smith from Invermere Custom Woodwork. I'm going to show you how I'm going to use my Festool TS55 to make a cut on this large piece that's too big to hold onto the chop saw um, such that I don't chip the lacquer that's on three sides of it. So we need a really clean cut. So I'm going to use the, the track saw as if it was a chop saw. So the technique on a chop saw would be to start by coming backwards and then plunge down and then come through that way. So we're going to have to run the saw backwards and you just have to be really careful when you do that because obviously it's like a climb route where you're, the tool is wanting to push the direction that you're moving it. So I've got my stock set here to present, prevent any serious catastrophes and I'm just going to run it at a very slight depth through the backwards part of the cut and be really careful. So you can see. Perfect.